Well, hello back people, welcome back to another part of Let's Play Jet Cocoon, part 14. Uh, and well, this part will be, uh, let's say short. Well, I expect it short because we'll just enter the gate and show you around all of that because I won't go back in further into the story as I want to make it in parts. So, well, let's go, go here. Let's... Yeah, there comes the match song. Now you see, now we will need Mabu to open this, which, can you hear me? This earthy smell, it seems so familiar, though I know I've never been here myself. Well, this is their homeland, we can say. This must be a memory from a past life. Yes, exactly. Well, Let's open the gate. Yes, Mabu, please open it. Hold my cocoon up high before the gate. I think that should work. Well, give it a try. Alright, let's try it. Come on, do it, guy. Now the gate will look at that. Look at that. You see, and come on, guys, it's just epic scenery. Now this is the moment. Now there's no going back. I can say there's no more going back. Either we just continue going. Well, oh, it's already now. Great. So yeah, after we we pass that, there's no going back. See now this is closing. No, no, no more going back for us. So yeah, now we're here in the temple. The time of gathering. The young will have nightmares. The old will be So before they are redeemed, the sun will go dark and the moon will turn to black. Wow. Promise land. Uh, Alright, so now we're back to another part of the story. Now let's look at this. Pretty nice, really nice scenery, the real nice work. Nice right now, you see, you have three gates. Well, uh, I will let it explain to you what the gates are. But. This is the temple is. of Kemuel, the home of the Nagi people. Exactly, exactly. What? I feel the presence of the chieftain from the middle hall. Let's go. Yes, let's go from the middle. In the middle. Let's go. So yeah, this is the temple of Kemble, which is what Mother Garai wanted you to go. And here we are. <laughs> so yeah, now this, now, this will be exciting. Uh, yeah. I think I will let you go for the cutscene and At last, talking. The time has come. The time of gathering. It is neat, it's the shit. I shall open the door, for I am the incarnation of Mephesis, gatekeeper of time. You may call me Ni. When the four divine barriers have been opened, the power of light and darkness shall usher in the time of gathering. It's pretty much the guardian deities of light and darkness shall be guided so yeah, by the dragons of Kumari. So yeah, I will actually go. And the Kumarian this... gates shall open. Uh, well, let's say. When the chosen ones pass through these gates, it's kind of hard to actually talk when I'm hearing this at the same time. The beasts of so what I want to tell is, well, I will let this roll so we we'll lose kind of time for the video to be at the full 15 minutes. Knowledge. Shall gain the fruit time as I don't want to be, to be too short or even too but long. It is the fruit that bears the seeds of admonition. So yeah, as you can see there are two also two. We chose a midwife to be the incarnation of the divine spirit Azura. Yes. And we sent her to Cyrus to confirm the rebirth of the chosen one. The midwife I speak exactly. of is Garai. Mother Garai. The prophet Gee spoke. Craft a ring from the tears of Reese 
and place it on the baby who arrives. The ring shall begin to glow when the chosen one is born. We have been waiting for that time. We are the chosen one. Wow. <laughs> Our souls have already experienced two ordeals. Oh, really? Lust was the first. The forbidden love of the divine spirit and the beast of knowledge. So, yeah. And then will... the birth of the twins who possess divine power. We gained love from the ordeal of lust, but at the same time, we came to no doubt. So now a lot of the story was explained the here. The divine power of the twins was divided into light and darkness. That was the first seed of admonishment. The seed took root, forcing the Nagi out of their village. That is when they began their quest for the yes. promised land. Promised land. Greed was the second ordeal. Greed. It's never something it good. Never be greedy, people. Alcana, it's always good to power, look out for your money, but never be greedy. That's something you should never be. It's greed. The love between That's never gave birth to the Money is the evil, to be honest. Divine silk was used in an attempt to conquer doubt and save love. Always save love, people. Always. But it did not work. King Karras, the Chosen One of Darkness, was dominated by greed. Light was torn from greed and became misery. And so was born the beast in our hearts. Wow. <laughs> the minions of the forest, the beasts in our hearts. This is the second seed of admonishment. Just a lot of talking, man. Once again, the time uh, after is here. he will destiny awaits. Stop All talking. Live with the child who was born that day. Yes, Lala. We name the child the Ray of Hope. It's Babu. Of course, it is Mabu of whom I speak. The birth of Mabu signifies the reincarnation of Menek and Karis. Like the light us. and the dark. As foretold by the prophecy, I sent Garai out on her journey with Mabu. You indeed are the chosen one of light, who was led here by the ray of hope. I you really understand a lot of, is it, 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 of the story, storyline of this game. It's pretty much everything kind of prophecy. The chosen one of darkness has already passed through the Kaya Gate. Yeah. Now he Just one of darkness you. is you must pass through the actually the last to reach guy it. battle in this game. Okay, tell us you shall use the keys <laughs> of the four divine barriers to summon the crystal for your first ordeal. Oh, there goes Mabu. Look at that. Just look at that. There we go. It's floating. <laughs> Before you can encounter the Chosen One of Darkness, you must undergo the ordeal of the Four Jewels. Yes, we will have to get Four Jewels. The first ordeal was solid. For this, you obtain the Jewel of Water. So, which means the first boss is in a lot of water. The remaining three ordeals are fire, air, and earth. These ordeals lie in the forest far away, beyond space and time. Yes. Now the second ordeal begins. You must venture to the beetle forest of the Netherworld. Got already one jewel. See that? That's Kaya Gate. What? Is something wrong? Ah, oh, you are worried about Mabu. Her metamorphosis is all. Why can't you leave the couple? You must save Mabu by Yes. Ocho, consult. I give you two knowledge. I am wrong. 
Ew, this is very pretty fight it. My name is Moon. Minions, and here is the one for the shot. So yeah, finally, after almost 10 minutes, I can finally, can finally show you the two other games. Yeah, there. Now you must. Jewel of Water. There we are. Now, this is where the game gets intense and exciting. This is where the part of fighting is one. So, so well, now let's go back. So now let's go to the left, which is the Chamber of Purity. It's very purified goes look at that. It's just light everywhere. This is perfect. It really made everything perfect in the ceiling. So now let's go back to this gate, which is the shop. And I'm going to show you something pretty epic. I am moved. Yes. Well, ask about the weapons. Now let's... I will show you one weapon. Which is crazy. Alright, alright. Iron sword? Alright. Little bird. Blue phantom. Oh damn. It's pretty good. Spring, spring blossom. Wow. 80,000. 80, well, look at the attack. The speed. Crazy, right? Armor. 20,000. Other. Oh, there's not much too. So yeah. This was it. Now we can say goodbye. Bye bye. So now yeah. See you back to the main hall. That's yeah. So this was it for this episode. Not a lot of excitement. Well, just to so you can really know about the story and get started to like feel like yes, now it's beginning. Now we will really fight. So yeah, I hope you still enjoy watching this part. We can say, and I hope I uh, see you in the next episode of Let's Play Jade Cocoon. Then we go to four first forest, which is the Beetle Forest, where we uh, fight against water. So the best for me would be to get air type minion, though I don't have one. But I have no wait, water is earth, yeah. Okay. Well I have my limit then. Pretty good. So I'm pretty much good up. So yeah. I hope you enjoy watching it. So like, share, subscribe as always. And uh, thanks for watching. So see you in another episode. Okay, bye people.